Com and today we are going to talk about Sony Ericsson P910i. Actually, I was uh, cleaning my cupboard and I saw the, uh, these booklets lying around, and uh, then I remembered my first phone, which was the Sony Ericsson P910i. So here it is. You can have a look at it. I don't have the handset at the moment, but at that time it was quite a slim phone. And uh, if you see this keypad here is remo uh, is removable and it had a really nice camera as per that time with a squared lens and uh, it had a uh, it was uh, with a resistive uh, touchscreen here was the scroll wheel the IR sensors the infrared and uh, the memory card slot the camera slot as it, uh, you can see it was Sony Ericsson so there is no doubt that the camera would have been quite nice uh, and it had a cyber shot feel and it was based on Java it had a flip keypad and a keyboard if you flipped it you would get a QWERTY keypad and uh, you could just remove it by a click like uh, this and uh, external antenna connector if you remove the back you could see a place on off button and nothing more like uh, the speakers here oh, for this to open here you can see if you flip open the device you would get a larger screen with more to see and uh, a full touch with a keypad QWERTY keypad if you can see and this with the Sony Ericsson and when you flip close you would get this screen or if in the application screen you would get a shorter screen and uh, okay for this page nothing on the top just the video with the monkey and the music icon which was quite uh, interesting to use because you would get a list here your music icon here your drag wheel the play saw button you could edit the music you could play alt uh, and anything uh, you have to remove the battery then insert the sim card you had quite an uneasy charger which i still have i remember and uh, I guess I lost the phone uh, or I kept it in the cupboard and forgot where it is. I am cleaning my cupboard and if I see it I will make a review video of it also. The jog dial, memory stick, You, uh, it didn't have uh, the micro SD card. It has the memory stick which goes into the PSPs and that's it for this manual. Let's keep it aside. This is quite a hefty manual. I'll just slip through it. It's a user guide. Okay. So it had really I cannot believe but it had the palm kind of thing. Like yeah. I still have um uh, I have a Sony Klee because at that time I was quite a Sony fan and I'll show it uh, show the same gestures were there in the Sony Klee I'll just show it to you in the moment so here's my Sony Klee as you can see it also uses a stylus but and here are the icons if you can see the drawing icons same are here you can match them so and they quite had the same kind of screen you didn't have to push that much if you would see it would sink quite in a little but they used to have a stylus then so i'll just throw this this okay the phone itself oh it had quite a lot of things let's see if i can remember them i guess this is a TV connector cable if you can also see earplugs the stylus I remember I got two of these the battery the memory card the memory card reader 
a screwdriver I did not get this why this is the part when you remove the keypad you would put this in so that it would fill in the hollow gap they use a manual two series I only got one or I don't remember the second one uh, the lanyard and what this I can't remember I guess it was the dock or something like that okay moving forward sim card insertion keypad insertion <laughs> they had quite a bit if you can see here there is a flip keypad is quite nice you can see the space bar alt key shift key and etc which are quite to be approved really I love this phone I lost it yeah your contacts were really nice same but you add a pick of them and then you add the contact you could contact them you could message them you could FB them you could uh, Twitter them I guess I remember the FB one and uh, its calling facilities were quite nice here are the pictures uh, it had quite a nice gallery you would change the gallery also moving forward the image editor you could edit the image the sound files the music player the sound file list the messaging uh, this was the messaging and um, to tell you it was quite an advanced java as per that time and if you see java phones at the moment which was the latest one uh, this one is much better and if you see um, if you compare Symbian and this operating system I would say Symbian is much better because so that's it for this video um, if you had this phone leave it in the comments below uh, what did you feel of, of it or if you want this phone where or if you have just purchased this phone leave in the comments where did you purchase this because I would really love to purchase this phone also and uh, if you have something uh, else uh, in your mind if you want some other video to be made or something some comment just put them in the comments below and if you like the video please press the like button or